Hi, this is Marcus Thomas with another tech tip from Kaiser Premier. Today we are going to go over air filter maintenance. Daily air filter maintenance is important since it's the final stage of filtration, preventing dust and water particles from entering the blower. Filter inspection is recommended every four hours, especially when working with sand or loose material as there will be a higher opportunity for carryover. The air filter is mounted inside the air filter housing, located on the driver's side in front of the debris or water tank. Remove the filter from its housing by disengaging the door latch and opening the door. Remove the wing nut in the center of the filter retainer and pull the retainer and filter out of the housing by gripping the air filter edge on opposite sides. Pressure from a garden hose with a nozzle is the maximum pressure allowable for cleaning the air filter without damage. Do not clean the filter or another component with the Hydrovax high pressure water system. This will result in damage and tearing to the filter media or other components. If oil gets in the filter, it can be treated with a detergent and a light scrub with a plastic bristled brush to clean the oil and particulates from inside the filter. Lightly apply a hand dishwashing fluid with degreasing capability to the outside of the filter and flush the filter completely using a garden hose and nozzle. Please note when washing out the air filter housing, avoid getting water into the blower as it can freeze and temporarily seize the blower. Water in the blower also causes excessive rusting. Leave the filter to dry completely before reinstalling it in the filter housing. It's recommended to let the filter dry overnight if possible. Inspect the rubber seals on each end for damage before putting it back in the filter housing. If the end seals are damaged, they can allow dirt to bypass the filter and enter the blower causing premature damage or failure. Any damage to a filter, such as dented framework, torn or washed away filter media, damaged gaskets, all void the warranty. So it's important to ensure that the rubber seals are intact. If the filter is damaged or fouled beyond cleaning, replace the filter. For optimal production, we recommend that two to three blower filter sets are used for most operations as part of a clean, dry, and use rotation. This will cover operation for a 12-hour shift. Once the filter is clean and dry, reinstall the air filter. If equipped, ensuring that the end without the two orientation tabs is placed back into the housing first. Confirm that the air filter frame is fully seated in the housing. Replace the aluminum retainer plate and wing nut and tight over the air filter. Please note that cross-threading the wing nut will prevent a properly tight seal resulting in damage to the blower. Close the air filter door and ensure that the air filter door is fully latched. Once the filter is reinstalled in its housing, you're all set to continue working. Thanks for stopping by and be sure to check back for other tech tips.